Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Karibuni tena. Welcome all. Leo tutafanya second paper 2, section 2. Max hiyo. Max paper 2, section 2. Uh, swali la variation and kindly subscribe to the channel. I'm just telling you uh, in advance subscribe na hii ndio namba yangu. Subscribe haya tuanze. Uh, question 17. A. The mass of a cylinder of a given material varies jointly as the square of the radius and as the height. Okay. If the radius is increased by 20% and height by 10%, what is the percentage increase in mass? So, which is very easy. So, mass ya cylinder, remember, it varies jointly as the square of the radius. So, as the square of the radius and also as the height. So, ikiwa yani utandika kiyo your notation ya fayu ya hivi. But, ikiwa utaeka equal sign, utatoa hiyo notation, utaeka constant, which is k lambda. So, uh, so your new m should be, kwa sababu hapa radius ume increase na 20%, your new percentage ya r, should be 120 over 100. So, one, 100 plus 20, obviously. So, 120 over 100 is just 1.2. So, half I have you, eh? 1.2 squared R squared. Na height yako is increasing by 10%, which is 110 over 100. So, it should be 1.1 times height. So, so this should be your new m and your new m equal to so 1.2 squared times 1.1 gives me 1.584 so k r squared height so this is all this you need my r money this there's a simple formula for it only answer to call parts 1.584 so this is your new so your new is 1.584 your original is, is always 1. So, for you to get the percentage increase, kwa vile ime increase, kwa sabo ni kutoka 1 paka 1.584. So, you take your new minus your original, divide by your original times 100. So, 0 0.584 if you subtract with 1 or from 1. So, it gives you 0 0.584 multiplied by 100. So there's an increase of 58.4%. So there's no need for you to write an increase because the question already, already told you is an increase. So there's no need for specification. So I'll pack up. So always indica increase okay by 58% by 58.4%. At Elena so la pili question B several companies were invited to an inspirational talk by a popular businessman man kama mimi the charge m in shillings per person for attending the talk is partly fixed and partly inversely proportional so that can be partly fixed hapo tayari ujue kuna constant yako ambao ya ketipikia so and partly inversely proportional to the number of people p so ya manisha hiyo p itakuwa konfano ikiwa ni jointly ah sorry nikiwa direct proportional p inge kwa juu lakini kwa vile ni Inversely, P itakwa chin. Paka hapa tumira. So the total number of P and in a company that will attend the talk. Question, Roman 1, express M in terms of P. So this is a partly variation. So partly variation is kama Y equal to MX plus C. This is just an example. So M, so Y is partly proportional to X and is also partly constant so this is the constant for y and also m is also the constant for y so i think that is all about partly variation so he m it equal to partly fixed which is your constant a plus there's another constant on top of p because above p is inversely proportional to m so this is your answer and you already got your one mark, and this is three marks. So how many marks to go? Six marks on. Aya. 
so 60 people uh, from company A attended the talk and their total charge was 30,000 80 people from company B attended the talk and their total charge was 36,000 36,000 what was the charge per person for company C C if 75 people from the company attended the talk so let's first find out the charge per person in company A because what happened 60 people and boy honey or the charge is 30,000 and 80 people were charged 36,000 and the question says what was the charge per person so first let's find out the charge per person so the charge per person for company A is simple you just take 30,000 divided by 60 people so the charge per person should give you around is it 5,000 no is around 500 shillings so for, cap. for company B the same thing the total charge need 36,000 divide by the number of people which is 80 and it should give you around 450 shillings okay what was the charge per person for company C the 75 people from the company attended at the talk Back up another knee to me, uh, to me, Leon. So you take your equation, which is this, okay? So m equal to a plus b over b. So p yako is the number of people which you know, and m yako is your price, okay? Is that price that you that you already know, okay? The price for a ni the price for b ni so let's find out the price so you take the first equation write it so m ya kwanza m equal to a you don't know your a so you just because you don't know your fixed price plus b also you don't know divide by the 60 people you get 500 shillings okay and also if you take a plus okay b over the 80 people you'd get 450 shillings so so this first equation and the second question so it's but let's first simplify it so for you to simplify the upper one come on simplify hapa juu ya kwanza multiply by 60 kote kote so 60 times 60 and times 60 now we simplify here pdp multiply by 80 multiply by 80 80 times 80 so hapa 60 times a and is 60 a okay plus b over 60 now here you talk about b equal to 450 times 8 450 times 8 450 times 8 it up for 3600 shillings so na hapa itakuwa 80a plus b equal to 450 times 80 450 times 80 ambo itakuwa wait wait a minute 500 times 60 500 times 60 in 30,000 not 3,600 sorry so hapa ya 5 kupe 30,000 30,000 now per 5 kupe or 50 times 80 36,000 so ni me replace you na chini so 36,000 so ni ki subtract ok let me subtract the 2 so we hindo equation 1 he ni equation 2 so na fani subtract so we nataka eliminate b and they have the same uh the same what do you call it same sign so same sign subtracts so 60 minus 80 a in negative 20 a equal to 30 minus 36 which is negative 6000 so a ningapi negative 6000 divided by negative 20 so 6000 iki divide na 20 itakupa 300 so tayari ushapata a yako but this about b right now kupata b yako pia ni the same thing with a substitute to touch for any of the equation okay well, let me just take the equation so you just take 60 times a which is 300 
plus b don't know b equal to 30,000 so 60 times 300 is 18,000 plus b equal to 30,000 so let's watch it to it with your there okay let me just to put it put it put it put it anyway I shall put a that so that e so b equal to 30,000 minus 18 18,000 to break at the other side so 30,000 minus 18,000 it up around 12,000 so answer go up on b equal to 12,000 that's so, what was the charge per person for company C uh, for company C so what yeah which call M equal to a a ni 300 sour plus B B a copy of shall you need 12,000 divide by the people uh, be up on 12,000 divide by 75 so M equal to so 300 plus 12,000 divide by 75 m yako itanipa 460 so 460 shillings that so another four marks so 20 so question draw man three so four marks uh, one mark four seven so uh, five eight so but do two marks two roman three when a person that had already paid the full amount uh, decided not to attend a request for a refund so he or she was only to be refunded the fixed charge so 25 percent of some people from company d requested for a refund uh okay requested for a refund after they decided not to attend the talk the talk organizer refunded them and were left with 22,800 shillings determine uh, the number of people from the company d that had initially paid the attendance okay but to me learn so the organizers refunded them even so so not a good after any total yeah how water so price yeah yeah water touch for healer 300 plus 12,000 divide by p because of here on the general equation yeah go see but that's and that times na p in the only total yake so it times na pita kwa pata total yake like he just per person but i want to find out per yani wote sa 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 so kifungua hii ita kwa sa sa 300 times p so ni 300 p plus 12,000 so this is the price for everyone so lazima like ni sa sa hiyo price ya kila mtu nita subtract now you are 25% of some people from company D. So, to subtract na uh, 0 0.25 times P. Kwa sababu, kuna, yani, wata refundio after they decided not to attend the talk. The talk organizers refunded them and were left with 22,800. So, lakini, wadi refundio anini? the fixed charge only and the fixed charge was 300 so 0 0.25 of the people of Mbohuyu times the amount yeah yo this is the only thing that they were refunded not other and come on fun come on 25 percent of 100 people so that you got 25 percent times you 125 times ile 300 so he price need a price and bow Omerigeshio ani ama bei ambao omerigeshio pesa ambao omerigeshio na hii ni price yao yote ndio maana kama multiply na p ndio nipate pesa yote ingekuwa nimeacha hivi ni nimeweka hapa itakuwa pesa pa person but now you've been asked to find uh, the total and the total hapa which you, you was left with was 22800 sawa so, kwa hapo so 300p okay 300p collect like terms uh, 0 0.25 p times 300 which was 0 0.25 times 300 that was 75 so minus 75 p plus 12,000 equal to 22,800
hii ukipeleka huku itakuwa wa minus na 12,000 so answer ya kwa hapa ni 22,800 minus 12,000 so hapa itakuwa 10,800 so 300 minus 75 itakuwa 225p 225p so divide by 225 divide by 225 so p equal to so 10,800 divide by 225 number p ni 48 people so apa kapa so uh, i think the answer we've already got it so till next time and don't forget to subscribe the channel wassalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh